Hello YouTubers and welcome to another beer review with me Peter the Master of Hoppets today doing a collaboration video with Saron from Rookie Beers. Yeah. So why don't you tell us a little bit about your blog? My blog? Oh my god. Just just quickly. Yeah. You have a yeah, blog. Yeah my blog. <laughs> my blog is about four years old now and um, yeah I'm reviewing a lot of beers. The latest was um, from Troppling, uh, what, what's it called? Toppling. Oh, oh yeah. Toppling yeah. Goliath. Yeah. So do Sue. Really nice uh, American Pale Ale, freshly hopped. So, yeah. yeah. Find me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and on tap. All that stuff. Rookie Beers. We're going to have the links <laughs> down below in the video so you guys can find it. Uh, he does, yeah, a written blog and also now pouring videos. Yeah. Blog and yeah. Stuff. yeah. So, yeah, check him out, guys. And uh, today we're going to be looking at some Italian craft beer. This is one of the beers that was sent to me from Box Beers. And also, got to say, I was mistaken in my previous videos. I said they only ship. To Sweden and Denmark, they actually also have an international part of the shop. Yeah, Buckbeer's Buck yeah. yeah. So they actually ship pretty much all over Europe. So check them out, guys. Great web shop. They sent me this bad boy, which is from Italy, from Toccalamato, and this is the Tabula Rasa Saison on 5.3% alcohol. They call this. They call themselves the Beer Freak Show for some reason. <laughs> and That's it's a pretty nice name. Yeah, and it's a extra dry and hoppy saison. Dry hopped with Amarillo and uh, Simcoe. And then they also use Paolo hops and then wheat and Pilsner malt. So it should be interesting. It's been a while since I've had a Saison actually, like mm -hmm. just a standard Saison. So let's get this one cracked open and poured. So we got the uh, Tokamatsu Tabula Rasa Saison poured. There is a big difference yeah. on that uh, Sarah got some of the yeast, so yours is what? More of a hazy? More of a hazy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, kind of look through. But it, it looks like a Saison. And yeah. you can kind of smell it already. It's like a nice yellow, hazy color. Yeah. yeah. White really nice. Still have your aroma on it. Yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah, that's almost very fruity. Mm hmm. Yeah. It almost smells like apple cider. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm getting like apple notes at least. Yeah. Are you smelling yeah. any of the, the hops? Mm -hmm. not, not likely, but more like the, the, the yeast. Yeah. Like the. the Estery, fruity, yeah, yeah, saison yeast. Yeah. I'm definitely smelling like classic saison aromas of like that kind of fresh grassy, yeah. maybe almost like a jammy stone fruit, like peaches or something like a stone fruit character, like yeah. a yeasty stone fruit. I don't know the age of this bottle, but it does smell like it is still just maybe a little bit hoppy. I'm getting yeah. maybe some citrus notes. Yeah, yeah. What about you? Mm. Oh, I think you have been... All around. <laughs> it, it smells like a pretty classic saison, just very fruity, yeah. and maybe a bit more hoppy. Yeah. Yeah. Some kind of like a little bit of sweetness, sweet maltiness with some wheat and whatnot. But it smells yeah. nice and refreshing. Let's give it a taste. Cheers. Cheers. And thanks to Buck Spears for the beer. That is pretty much like a very refreshing, sessionable saison. Yeah. It's I like know, it, I smell the hops and I smell the hops. Taste hops. Yeah, there's definitely more hop quality yeah. on the flavor. Yeah, and it's also more bitter than an yeah. average saison. Yeah, yeah, and the uh, apples disappear. And yeah, 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 and you get more of a bitter, dry, maybe yeah. almost earthy aftertaste. Yeah, because that yeah. kind of apple cider is aroma is definitely yeah. not on the flavor. Very light though mm. on the mouthfeel, like yeah. a light yeah. body. The carbonation is really. Really good. Yeah, like very, it's very fizzy, yeah. but yeah. it's really nice in the style, yeah. I think. Yeah. Um, it's very fresh. Yeah, like very fresh, very spring-like actually, yeah. which yeah. is fitting for yeah. like the weather, like the Easter weekend is coming up. So yeah. this is pretty, I actually think they're going to see this review on Easter. So happy Easter <laughs> to everyone. <laughs> I think this is going to be airing Easter Sunday, but I actually think speaking of Easter, this would be good with Easter food, like lamb and stuff mm. like that. Yeah, like a refreshing beer to all the heavy stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And like hop wise, I think I might be tasting the Simcoe the most because I'm getting that kind of almost grapefruit citrus mm. and almost like some dankness. Yeah. But the stone fruit character isn't really there on the flavor. I actually think it's more citrus fruit on the flavor. It's not yeah. that kind of. It's you taste the yeast, but it's not that jammy fruitiness. It's more yeah. the, the hops shine more through in the yeah. flavor. Yeah. It's kind of like citrus fruits, maybe lime even, and lemony, yeah. maybe yeah. a little bit yeah. orange. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, grapes, grapefruit, and and also a little bit of the wheat is definitely shining through. I guess slightly chewy mouthfeel, but it is a lighter. The wheat, yeah, it's also yeah. made with oh, the wheat. Yeah. Yeah. You do five, 
Yeah. On yours, so let's let's let you can do your scale and I'll do mine. <laughs> so out of okay, five, okay, okay out of five, we'll get this one. Four. Yeah. Four caps. I was thinking straight up ninety. Mm. So that's I guess four is about yeah. the same as yeah. ninety. Yeah. So uh, it's a really nice, refreshing, easy going to song yeah. with a kick of more hops and for five point was it five point three percent, which is not super high. It's actually got a good amount of flavor. Mm. The only like detractor for me is the mouthfeel. It's very light. But mm. again, yeah. makes it a refreshing spring yeah. time here. So uh, yeah, guys, if you get the chance, definitely check out the Tokonomato Tabula Rasa Dry Hop Saison. And if you can't get this bad boy, you can get it on Box Beers. Yeah. So thanks a bunch of Saison for joining. Uh, we have a couple more beers to try as well. Yeah. Some Saison and some crazy good barrel aged stuff. <laughs> Should be good. Yeah. So check them out again, guys. And thanks so much for joining. And uh, yeah, remember to comment, subscribe. Check out the Facebook fan page and Twitter and Instagram. I want to say cheers. <laughs> See you guys <laughs> in another interview. <laughs>